On Afghanistan and this game, the, the fastballers didn't start too well or the power play didn't go too well. And just additionally, the uh, uh, the team also lost four wickets today quite early before getting to 100. And it has been happening for eight out of the last 10 times that they haven't scored 100 runs before. So these two things, like the starts, um, has that also been bothering you as the head coach? Um, if you don't get a start, if you lose more than, I mean, three wickets early power play, you're not winning ma many matches. So definitely it's a concern um, for batting. We need to, because when we play seven batters also, we want our top order to fire. So that's a big concern. Um, you're right. Um, the fast bowlers, I mean, uh, unusually they were off colour last two games uh, in, in the power play. So normally... Um, on a day game, the early on, there is a little bit uh, into the uh, for the fast bowlers. Even this game, there was a same movement early on, a little bit tacky and two pace. Um, so, uh, the two openers were uh, pretty much, I mean, play and misses and then miss hits. Um, then they were a little bit lucky and then after that, they batted really well. So if we have get some early wicket, uh, the story would have been a bit different. Uh, coach, just additionally, in the Afghanistan game, you bowled outside the off stump, took seven wickets in that zone, but you tried the same thing today quite repeatedly, but you got hit for 16 boundaries. When I mean, you bowled almost the same amount of balls outside off stump, you think they didn't have a plan B, the, all the bowlers, I'm talking about spinners and fast bowlers. So was there a lack of plan B in the bowling? Uh, it, it was, the plan was not to bowl outside the stump. The plan was to bowl at the stump. I think the um, execution let us down. Um, this game especially. Um, you rightly said the last game also, like we came back later uh, with the, the help of the spinners. This game, what happened was the, our spinners also um, yeah, bring, didn't bring us into the game because the, with the good intelligent batting, I would say. Uh, Sandiga, uh, we saw the inconsistent batting for a long time, from a long time, but how do you describe the bowling effort today? Yeah, as I said, the, we were a little disappointed the way we start. We could have uh, bowled a little bit more um, onto the stumps, especially at the start, first 10 overs. Um, we came back well, um, especially uh, sorry full. Um, I, I thought very brave to bowl uh, those variations when we were really under pressure. They would have got 400 um, at, at one stage, I thought. Um, so there are some positives, but then, yeah, we didn't bowl well. Uh, Chandika, yeah. Did you miss uh, Vadat Hussain Chaudhary today, especially in the middle overs where England scored heavily? Just a second one, except for Leighton Das innings. Uh, do you think there, is, there were anything positive to take away from this game? Yeah, those are the, I mean, biggest positive is to take away from this game. Leighton coming to form the way he batted was a uh, uh, good, good sign for us and good sign for him as well. Uh, we know that he's a match winner. We need runs from the start. Um, we can't keep losing early wickets. So um, he come into um, form and then Mushi getting some runs is, is a good positive. And the Ivadat part? Yeah, I mean, Ivadat is not unfortunate not to make the um, the World Cup. Uh, even if he's there, we would have, yeah, we had other options, but then we played three fast bowlers and they, they had done the job for us in the past. So I think it's this last two games is a bit of a uh, two off days, I would say. They've been bowling well. Coach, uh, here. I was asking the same question to the, to David Malan. Uh, is Bangladesh uh, made a mistake to, uh, about, about reading the pitch and choose to field first? What was Sri Ram input in these things? Because he was here. I, we heard that he was here but to give this type of input. I didn't, I didn't understand the second one. The first one is, I, I, I don't think it's we made a mistake by bowling first. Um, because of the wicket had something, and especially with 10 o'clock, 10.30 start, and then yesterday, a little bit of rain, there was something on the wicket. Um, the fact was that we didn't bowl good areas. We didn't, um, our lengths and lines were not good. Uh, you asked something, I didn't get it. What was Sri Ram input yeah, about, the, about, the, about this? Yes, Sri Ram is here to, uh, as a consultant for us, um, and he, he's been with us in the last World Cup, so um, his, his role is uh, vast, not only about the pitches. Uh, coach, uh, obviously there have been a lot of talks about the failure in the opening spot and uh, since the openers have not fired yet, uh, do you think it's a bit of concern moving forward uh, since you ha you don't have much of a option left in the opening spot? 
which is a concern if you're not scoring. But then uh, Litton coming into form this game, um, good positive for us. And then um, the Tanzi scored runs in the two practice games, um, so he was in form. So there's two. Um, two failures in, in the World Cup. It can happen um, any, for any team. So I'm hoping those two, those guys will fight because o most of the batters now got into form, and uh, coming games we will hopefully uh, perform as a group. Coach, uh, I have two questions. Uh, the first one is, uh, I just uh, like to know the how the team function because you have uh, three major figures in the team. Khaled Mahmoud as a team director, you're obviously the head coach, and Sridharan Sridham came as a consultant. I just want to know about the working process of you three. And another part, it, all other teams are sending their players. We're very happy to give, uh, get you, don't misunderstand me. But Bangladesh is not sending any players to the press conference before the game or after the game. Is that a team decision to, uh, to take the pressure off something like that? Or do, do you think media thing is very big distraction for the players? Okay, first question because you know that I can't remember some of the time. First one is uh, three, three, three questions. How you function? Khalid Mahmoud, you ah, yeah, the, the team management. Yeah. Yeah, it's functioning well. Khalid uh, is a uh, is a manager or the head of the delegation. Um, Sri Ram is consultant, and I'm the head coach. So I'm very happy with that. Um, the how he's functioning. Uh, there's no issue in that. Uh, the, what is the second one? So I know your post, but uh, I just uh, want to know the modality of your function. What's the? Is there any job description you have just given to Sri Ram, or Khalid Mahmood taken care of any certain things? Uh, there's no such a thing as that. They they all contributing towards uh, the team, and um, they're free to do uh, contribute the way they they, they see is right. Yeah, I'm very comfortable with that. But the second question? Yes, I know. Oh. Ask him. <laughs> well, I have no idea. Okay. Yeah. Third one. Last two questions. Uh, don't you think? Don't you think uh, you have a big leakage in the opening stand, batting opening stand? Uh, young chap is not playing uh, his best in this tournament. He's just got out two times in a row. It's yeah. Just... Um, you're right. He got out two times, and but he was in the run in the first two practice game as well. So. Um, he's just getting into international cricket. Um, if you judge someone with two innings, then Malan would have, would not be playing this game as well. So we have to be patient. Thank you. Thank you.